in my heart I always I wanted to have your baby, but you said you didn't want to be a father, so I thought it would be best if you just didn't you know. You lied to me to protect me. You lied to shut me out. I know that's how it seems, okay? But I realize that you can't... You can't lie about a child for your own convenience, not because you justify to yourself that the father would be better off not knowing or the child would be better off not knowing who the father is. Robin, I didn't want a baby in the abstract when, when your pregnancy was still a hypothetical and you took that as a chance to, to, to never tell me that it was my baby in the first place. Look, I know I made a mess of this. And, and it's so ironic because out of all people, <laughs> I mean, I should know the damage that comes from lying about a child. I had a front row seat when Carly and Jason were lying about Michael. I mean, to go even further back, when my mom lied to my dad about me and he didn't even know about me for the first six years of my life, my mom was wrong. Carly was wrong. And now, you know, it's, it's, it's my child. It's a baby that's growing inside of me, a baby that you said you didn't want. And so I lied and I was wrong. And I'm sorry. And I, I, I mean, I'm trying to undo it, but I'm just... Obviously, making a mess of that, too. Oh, hey, 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 just calm down. You're having a little mood swing, I think. <laughs> I think. Just, here, sit down for a second. When I came to you the night of Georgie's funeral, I just felt hopeless. You know, her death was like confirmation that nothing good ever lasts. And so I needed to be with you. I needed to be with with you because when we were in love I remembered what it was like to be happy and that was when we made our child and I'm so thankful for that I'm so grateful to you because you know whatever happens you've given me the greatest gift that I will ever receive I'm glad we are father of your baby. That was my initial thought when I figured it out. That we'll always be connected because, you know, we made a child together. And I thought you were just angry with me for not telling you. Kidding me? I was furious. I was terrified. I was thrilled and awed, but I was confused. I still am. Oh, don't take this the wrong way, but you sound just like an expectant father. Did you see Carly tonight? No. Well, you came in through a different direction, so did you hear or see anything? Um, just your note that's holding my brother at gunpoint. Is this your phone? Tell me the truth, is my brother okay? Is this your phone? Why? Because if not, it's Carly's, that means she's close by. Why? So you just, you heard me yelling for her? That's very sweet. So you just laid there while I was yelling for Carly, thinking it was, it was her and it wasn't? John, and it was you? I thought you were going to leave me buried there. Then I will never know. Hey! I want to Stop grabbing here. her. That way. But that's true. John? Why were you both in the hand? Personal reasons. Personal, huh? For the last time, did you ever try to get Richard to sign over those deeds to the properties to me? He's your son. He could be trapped or dying in there. You know, you better hope that he doesn't. Because if he does, I have no longer any need for you. <laughs> this is your last chance. You better be here, friend when he comes out, and you better tell him to get rid of those properties, sign them over to me, because this building, they almost killed him. So, what do we got? Who's still missing that we know of? Richard at St. Carly Jacks and Claudia's car I haven't been seen since the explosion. We still have three civilians on the inside. Sonny Corinthos, Jasper, and Jerry Jackson. I feel like I'm a person. I don't know what you're here. Any sign of Carly? No, no, sorry. 
Yeah, to get back in. No, the firefighters are taking care of it. There's nothing you can do. So if you were just getting in the way. No, no, we, we, we made it a point to avoid the intrepid rescue process. You can stop with the winning remarks for two seconds and try to save your brother from killing yourself. I'm not going to kill myself. Okay? I'm going to look for my wife. No, you're not. The it's firefighters right. are doing their job. Carly There's could be nothing you can do. Carly could be running around in there looking for Michael. She doesn't know that he's already out here, or she's too badly hurt to move herself. Either way, she needs me. Please don't okay? do this. What are you talking about? Harper, I need two to You can't to stop me from here. looking for my wife. I don't, these two. I don't want them off the premises. I don't want them in that building. Don't let these two in the building. If they resist, arrest them. This has the potential to go really badly for you, Alexis. And if something happens to Carly, I'm not sure I can forgive you. You can blame me all you want. At least you'll be alive. No, 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 no. We can't do anything. We, can't do, we don't have the equipment. The fire's getting out of control. It would be stupid to, to die looking for Carly while she's coming out the other entrance. Where have you been? Why are you here? I was in the building with my sister and Sonny when the place blew up. This doesn't make sense. Carly was supposed to be in there too. Yeah, well, I found her kid, Michael. I took him around the other side. He was buried under a pile of rubble. And... You're the one who saved Michael? Well, I heard him yelling, so I dug him out. I'm sorry, I tried looking for your cousin, but there wasn't time. The roof was burning, and I had to get my glass on Because so the fire crews are, are looking for Carly. Yeah, everybody's looking for Carly. Nobody's looking for my sister, except for me. Excuse me. As a woman been evacuated, Claudia is a car. She's five six, dark hair, dark jacket, uh, black pants. Um, so far we've only evacuated one woman, a Mariana Rosa. Mm -hmm. All right, I gotta go for my sister, but you may be able to find Carl. No, no, the firefighters are doing it. You don't have to go back inside. Oh, she's in sick. I know. It's. It, I know it's very hard to wait, but we can wait together. You don't know your sister very long, but I'm sure she's capable of taking care of herself. While you were stuck with your father, that's exactly what she was doing. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just worried about you. Okay, you don't understand how my family works. I have to go find her. Carly! Where are you? If you're here... Oh!